Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are making one of my absolute favorite Valentine's Day shakes, which you can see right here, and it is called the Cupid's Crunch. There's something about this shake, I don't know what it is, but it's delicious, and I hope you guys enjoy it as much as I do. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how I am measuring my cup. This is the cup I'm gonna use, so I filled it all the way with ice, and then I filled it a little over halfway with water. That's how I measure my shakes. I don't do it by cups or ounces or anything. So this is a cup I'm using, filled it with ice, then I filled it a little over halfway with water, dumped it in my blender, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to chop up the ice water before I start adding my products. Um, this is how I've been doing it for, mm, I would say eight years now, it just seems to make the shake just better. I don't know, just, that's what I do, that's my habit. Try it out, see if you guys like it. If you don't, at least you tried. <laughs> so now I'm gonna go ahead and add in my products. So I'm starting off here with our French Vanilla Formula One. I love this flavor because you can just do so much with it. I'm gonna go ahead and add two scoops of French Vanilla Formula One right into my blender. And then I'm going to grab my protein. And again, this is vanilla. So it is going to be the vanilla protein drink mix. And I'm going to add a scoop in there. If you need two scoops, according to your meal plan, add two scoops. But for purposes of the video, I'm making it for myself. Then I just need one. So I put one scoop. And then I have my almond extract. And I'm going to just get my Herbalife measuring spoon and put a half a teaspoon, which is the small side, and pour it right in there and add it to my blender. Almond extract is amazing when you add it to French vanilla, like no matter whatever else you do. And then I'm going to get my cheesecake pudding mix. So if you don't order cheesecake pudding mix from Herb Herbalife, you can go to the store and just get the blue box, which is sugar-free jello pudding mix. So that is the cheesecake flavor. Just remember, look for the blue box because that means it is a sugar-free cheesecake pudding mix. And then I have some almonds here. It'd probably be easier to buy some crushed or slithered almonds, but I obviously didn't have any left. So I'm using whole almonds and I'm just crushing it up real quick using <laughs> the famous garlic crusher. So I crushed up a couple almonds and I'm just going <laughs> That's me showing you my artwork. So I'm going to get my measuring spoon and I'm going to grab a tablespoon of that and add that right into my blender. Hence the name Cupid's Crunch because, you know, it has a little crunch to it. I'm telling you, this shake is delicious. So if you're not going to sell it in your club, you got to at least try it. you got to make it and just try it for yourself so you can just love on it the way I do. So... <laughs> That is what I'm going to add into my blender and I'm going to go ahead and mix that up. And as that is blending, I just want to take a second to thank everyone for liking, commenting, subscribing, and turning on notifications so you know when my next video hits. Thank you all for sharing my YouTube and subscribing to my YouTube. And also thank you guys for following my Facebook and watching the reels of the little short reels that I make. So thank all of you guys for that. Thank you for purchasing my recipe book on Facebook. I cannot believe that I've sold over 900 recipe books. So thank you guys so much for that. I appreciate it more than you'll ever know. So now I have my little cherries here and I am going to get my Herbalife measuring spoon because I use it for everything. And I am going to pour the juice from the cherries. That's weird, right? I don't know how I came up with this, but it was, it just, it's amazing. So I'm putting a tablespoon of the cherry juice at the bottom of my cup, kind of like you would when you're doing like a lift off shake, but it's just cherry juice. And honestly, I think that's what makes the shake just amazing. So you're going to pour that into your cup. And as you're pouring it on top of the cherry juice, it creates this nice little eye candy look for you. So if you have a club, you can make the cutest shake doing this. And if you're doing it for a family member, you can ooh and awe them because I mean, look how cute it is. It looks like you just went to one of these shake shops, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, that is how you make that 
prettiness on the cup. And then we are gonna go ahead and just shake it a little bit so it evens out before adding my whipped cream to the top, just like this. And you can add whatever whipped cream you want. Honestly, I think this was the gingerbread whipped cream that I'm just trying to use up. <laughs> so now I'm going to get a little bit more of my almond crushes and just sprinkle those right on the top because almonds are just amazing and it's going to give a nice little touch to the crunch. And then we're gonna get our Valentine's Day sprinkles because of course, what is a Valentine's Day shake without Valentine's Day sprinkles? And I'm like a sprinkle head, so I have this huge box with thousands of different kinds of sprinkles and it's hard for me to choose, but this one was perfect for this shake, right? Look how cute. So I'm just gonna sprinkle that right on top, just like this. And then, of course, to top it off, we're going to grab our cherry jar again that we stole the juice from. And we're just gonna take a cherry right out of there and add it to the top of the shake because as they say, that is the cherry on top. So this is the Cupid's Crunch. Like I said, if you're not gonna try it as a specialty shake for the month of February or even January, you know, to go into February, just try it. It is so good. I'm actually gonna make this for dinner now because I just watched this video and it's so delicious. So I love you guys. Thank you for liking, commenting, subscribing. Thank you for turning on notifications. This is a better view of it. Look how good that shape looks. <laughs> love you guys. Thank you for all of your love and support. Thank you for purchasing my Herbalife book. Thank you for following me on my socials and I will see you guys on the next video.